John, you know, I know earlier this year I saw you were in Vegas. You were, you were bouncing around from gym to gym, uh, and you hit up the Mayweather gym. You got what was your time? You know, you worked a little with Floyd Senior, Roger. What was your time around those guys? I honestly, I had a great time. Those guys were funny as as heck. <laughs> They're funny as heck. I had a great time with them. Uh, Floyd Senior is a good coach. He's a good coach, even though he has a big ego like his son, but he's a good coach. Uh, I like him, I like his son as well. They are, they, they are good people, they are good people. Roger, like even though he's sick, he's still going to the gym every day. That, that thing is so amazing, like you're sick and you're still going to the gym every day. Like it's because he really, really love boxing. He really, really love his sport. And uh, I had a great time with those people, with the Mayweather family. Uh, they taught me a lot in few few weeks, few days. They taught me a lot, and and the tricks that they showed me, I'm trying like to polish that. And probably I'm gonna go back uh, to to the gym to see them and probably to do few things with them because they're really really good coaches. But what made you reach out and say I want to uh, just try Vegas out and link up with these guys? What prompted that move? Because Vegas is the, is the capital of boxing, you know. If if you want to be a, a great champion, I think that you need to go to Vegas a little bit, or you need to go train a little bit to Vegas because all the great champions went there, trained there also. So I said, uh, if I want to, so if I want, if I want to be one of the best or the best in the world, I need to follow like those steps. And uh, that's why I like did, and also that's why I came here, you know. Uh, they done it before me, and I'm gonna do it. And probably like the next generation will do it after me as well. What did you notice about each of their techniques as a trainer, their abilities as a trainer? Uh, the, their approach are different. Floyd, you know, it's more about the defense. And Roger, it's more about the uh, offense. Roger's offense, offense, offense. Floyd, uh, it's defense first. You know, don't get hit and don't get hit. You know, that's his things. And I saw both together could make like a tremendous team. Okay, what about their personalities? Just the way they act and everything. Like I said, they're funny. They're funny. You cannot get bored with them. Like uh, they always uh, stay cracking up jokes. They always they also they also straight up to you. If they don't like you, you will know for sure they don't like you. If you ain't good, you will know you're not good. <laughs> If boxing is not for you, they're gonna tell you straight up to you like leave the gym. <laughs> That's where I am for you. Yeah. So so they really direct people, and uh, and and you just can't have fun with them. And Floyd now he's you know he hits the mitts with Roger, works with Roger. He also has his dad in his corner. You think he has like the best of both worlds? Exactly, like I said, he has the best of both worlds because Roger is offense, offense, and Floyd is defense. Hit and don't get hit. So I think like uh, his team, the man with his team, Floyd got the got one of the best team in the world. Also, thank you.